What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Mr. VAZ. I'm back. Welcome back to Delivery Stories. Like, comment, subscribe. Do what you do. Let's get into this Instacart order right here. As you can see, I put hell no because I'm just not doing this. So let's break this down, especially if you're a new driver or whatever, or you just want to see this. Um, the blue circle on the top left side, that's where I'm at, okay? In the middle of the picture, obviously you see all these, and the customer, the house all the way on the right center, okay? First off, let's acknowledge that the fact that they threw me an, over, an order being all the way over here, where I'm at at the blue dot, that means nobody next to the supermarket of Aldi's is even accepting this order. That should let them know not to even throw it to somebody that's farther. But let's get into it. It's an extra $5 batch. And it says until 1 o'clock, right? So this order was actually $19.88 with no tip. I won't be saying that word a lot, no tip. With the 5 extra, it's $24.88 with still no tip. So let's break down the items. 79 items, okay? 123 units. People that don't know what units are, pretty much look at the bottom. As you can see, that tomato, it says it, um, they say they want two tomatoes. So pretty much tomatoes, one item, but it's two units. So you add that to the unit side. So in other words, so you won't get confused, you're going to have 123 pretty much items in your fucking car, pretty much, regardless how they put it. From the all these, it says it's seven miles. This is the reason why I wouldn't take it because I know that area. That area's traffic sucks. And not even that, You for all those units and items you're shopping for, if I were to take this order, it would take me about, by the time I start driving complete and take it to the customer, two hours, and I'm being generous with the two hours because this probably would take way longer than that. For $24.88, is not worth it. It shows you that some customers just don't appreciate us. Some people will say, hey, he might give you a great cash tip. Okay, well, guess what? That's a chance I'm not willing to take. You're going to give me a great tip. Put it on there. Motivate me to do this. For me to do this order, I'm going to be straight up honest with you. For me to do this order, 79 items with 123 units coming from where I'm at to do this whole order, I will need at least, and I'm being generous, $100. Straight up, a hundred bucks. I don't care if it's like you know combined with the tip and the Instagram. I would need a hundred bucks, even though I know in some markets you get way more than that for this type of order. But a hundred bucks, I will probably do it and end my day pretty much. So that's just insane, guys. Please be careful out there what you pick. Okay, um, be smart with your mileage, with your time. That is not worth that time for the simple fact. That where I'm at, there's a supermarket. I could do an order with 15 items for $25, $30. I've done orders for $45 with 25 items. Don't think about the number. Think about what you're doing with your car and your time. All right, guys? So be out there. Stay safe. Be smart with your batches. Don't forget to subscribe and do what you do. As you can see, I got an order up here I need to check. Have a good one, guys.